Hey, what's going on? This is Andre Sweeney, the Life Specialist. Welcome to the Good Life Show, the show that gives you the tools and principles necessary for an outstanding life. Today's segment is called The Quote of the Day, and today's quote is, The only way to make a man trustworthy is to trust him. This quote is by Henry Stimson. I'm going to repeat it one more time. The only way to make a man trustworthy is to trust him. I don't know if I totally agree with this quote. I don't think you can make anybody trustworthy. I think it's up to that person to establish trust. And then based on that, you either trust them or you don't. But I do believe that you can't trust a person until you give a person an opportunity. And many of us, that's where the problem is. We won't even give a person a chance to prove if they're trustworthy or not. We all want friends. We all want relationships. All of us want to be married or, or, or of some kind. And the problem is many of us are afraid based on previous experience. Previous baggage, previous letdowns, previous hurts, previous times when we put ourselves out there and we opened up our hearts and someone stepped on it. Well, the bottom line is it's not my fault if your last boyfriend hurt you. It's not my fault if your friend, uh, if you loaned your friend $100 and he didn't pay you back. When you get into new relationships with people, you have to establish those relationships based on what they do. Now, yes, be smart. Yes, take those previous failures and learn from them. But still, when it comes down to it, that person has to have a clean slate. And you have to give that person an opportunity. So, you cannot deem a person not trustworthy if they haven't done anything and if you haven't opened up a door to see if they can walk through it or not. So, bottom line is, if I'm your friend, you're going to have to take a risk. Any financial investment takes a financial risk to complete it. If I put my money in the stock market, there's a risk. I either hit or I miss. But the bottom line is in relationships, it's the same way. You have to allow yourself to a degree, not telling you to be stupid. Of course, guard your heart. But at the same time, there is a vulnerability that is mandatory if you're going to fall in love. There is, a, there is a vulnerability that must take place in order to find out if a person is husband or wife material. I can't trust you if I won't allow myself to take the risk to trust you. If a person is going to be deemed trustworthy, you have to step out there and see. You have to, you have to put your hand out there and test the wind. See where they're coming from. You have to see if this person can keep a secret. You have to find out if this person, uh, if you can confide in this person and, and, and they won't hurt you with that valuable information. If you're going to find out if a person is trustworthy, you have to find out. That's the only way to do it. Okay? Taking references is not good enough. Going, going on based on what other people did in your friendships, it's not good enough. You have to find out with each and every person that you deal with. Now, I admit, it's a scary proposition. But the only, find, the only way to find out if a person is trustworthy is to see if they're trustworthy. This is Andre Sweeney, the Life Specialist, and I'm here to help you get a life.